As of Friday morning, 158 new cases of COVID-19 were confirmed in Armenia and the total number has reached 42,477 in the country. Also, six more deaths from the coronavirus were reported, making the respective death toll 842 cases. The total number of people who have recovered so far is 35,693 and the number of people currently being treated is 5,689 in Armenia. Armenia ranks 21st in terms of COVID-19 death toll per 1 million people with 284. In terms of the absolute number of deaths, Armenia now ranks 49th in the world with 842 in total and 6 in the last 24 hours. After confirming 42,477 COVID-19 cases in Armenia since the beginning of this pandemic, the country is currently 54th place in the world and 13th in terms of COVID-19 cases per 1 million residents. Russia and its partners in the OSC Minsk Group are working on the earliest possible resumption of talks on the Nagorno-Karabakh settlement, Russian Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov said in an interview with Truth newspaper, TASS reported. We are expecting early resumption of the negotiation process on the Nagorno-Karabakh settlement. We are working on this together with our partners in the OSC Minsk Group, he said. Lavrov noted that the July border conflict between Armenia and Azerbaijan was the second most widespread violation of the 1994 ceasefire agreement. The Russian co-chair of the OSC Minsk Group on Nagorno-Karabakh, Igor Popov, has been in direct contact with the leadership of the four ministries of the two countries all this time. As a result, with active Russian mediation, a ceasefire has been reached since August the 16th, albeit not on the first attempt, the Russian foreign minister noted. By the President's decree and the petition of the Prime Minister, Captain Ruben Sanamian has been awarded the Order of the Homeland, being awarded the highest title of National Hero of Armenia. As an officer and commander, Captain Sanamian has shown exceptional courage, selflessness and bravery in ensuring the defense and security of the homeland, the President's office reported. By the same presidential decree, 199 more servicemen of Armenia have been awarded state awards for their selflessness while defending the borders of the homeland and for their bravery and skill during the military actions. The criminal case under investigation into a 57-year-old Khashtarag village residence causing serious bodily and psychological harm to his underage grandchildren has found out that his 28-year-old daughter also had regularly beaten her five minor children as well as her brother's two underage sons, the Investigative Committee of Armenia informed. A new criminal case was initiated in connection with this incident and a decision was made to merge the two criminal cases and continue the investigation under one proceeding. These seven kids have been recognized as injured parties. A forensic medical examination has been ordered for them. The aforesaid 28-year-old resident of Hashtarak was detained on Thursday. The investigation continues.